man, um, I was ranting to myself because there's been some things happening in the world right now and it's probably happening everywhere to y'all too where many people are taking the name of Jesus out of everything, out of public school, out of, I mean, everywhere. I mean, just everywhere because the name of Jesus has so much power. I believe the name of Jesus is destroying the plans of the enemy and so the enemy is trying his best to take the, the name out of every little thing, out of everything. And, and it's, it's, it's getting worse. It's getting worse every day where people are just mock you because of your faith. People just don't understand how great God is. They don't understand how great the great I am is and how great he's been to each and every one of us. They will never understand it, but I pray for them every day that they experience the same thing as well. Every day is a challenge. Every day going through persecution, going through attacks from the enemy to tempt us, to destroy us. You know what hard it is. And people just still mock us there too. But I'm here to tell you this. God has been so faithful to each and every one of us. He's been there every day in our lives. He's been there everywhere we go. It's just been so hard because right now we live in the last days right now. And these are very, very tough times. Very tough times. And every day you just looking like, how much longer, Lord? But at the same time, you can't give up. You can't give up in Jesus. You cannot give up at all. You cannot give up right now. Even though it's tough right now and we're going through the woods right now, you can't give up in Jesus' name. You can't just give up. I know I've lost so many times. I may have fell back in the sin. I may have slipped up a few times. I may have said something wrong towards somebody, but I still forgive them. I still repent because God has been so faithful to me. Right now, brothers and sisters, in Jesus' name, don't give up in the Lord. He is our strong tower. He is our shield of faith. He is, he is our strong foundation, our rock that we stand on. Thank, thank you, Holy Spirit, for being a teacher to us, for teaching us that these are the last days. It's hard right now. It's hard because of the evil that's growing inside the world, like like growing vines, just, uh, just, just entangling and just wrapping around the trees so tightly the trees fall apart. The evilness is growing thick, even even sometimes in the children too. I heard what happened to an eleven year old boy who dressed up as a as a um a drag queen. Like what is going on? It's a it's a confusion the enemy is bringing to the to the youth towards everyone he can so that when the great tribulation comes many people will be left behind to face the things that they don't want to ever face in their life they don't want to face the things that's going to come man i pray every day in jesus name that people would just wake up and see the truth that they wake up and see what's happening inside the world the lord is coming back he could come back in a week come back in a month he come back any time but he is coming back you better be ready in Jesus' name. You better be ready when he comes back. I love y'all with a great love, with the greatest love ever, because I know God has been so faithful to me, to you, to, to, to everyone. The world is just so lost. Jesus is the only hope right now. And they're taking the name of Jesus out of everything. Look at that now. They're taking the name of Jesus out of everything because they know they know the name of Jesus has power. And so use his name. Don't be afraid, but trust in God. Soon we will see our king. We will be in heaven with the Lord, having a, the greatest celebration ever. That even man can't even measure this compre comprehension of this praise and glory we give to God. Amen. Be thankful. Forgive one another. Treat each other like Jesus treats us. Show love. Show compassion. No matter what the enemy says towards us. No matter what he curses us, our cup runneth over. We have an enemy sitting on our table right now cursing us. Talking to, talking to, you know. But trust in the Lord. And God bless.